Hey guys, it's Andrea with Sex For You and this is a two month update on the astrophytum seeds. I started back in February and I think it's time to finally add some more water to the bag. I have I don't want to leave them open for too long but you can see they're getting chubby good stuff huh okay so I'm just going to actually take some filtered water and pour it into the bottom of the bag and then zip it right back up about like that and I'm gonna see that to all of these guys and then it'll bring it up in the bottom and the condensation will help keep them watered for at least another month move that to the side for now and you can see this black pad is a heating pad and I recently turned it off because it's just been warming up here so much and they were under grow lights in the garage so it was getting pretty warm All right. these were a five rib astrophyta mysterious this is the uh, Asterius Iwata. I'm about to wata these. I'm so silly. You all know me. I love me a pun. Can't help it. And then I'm going to do that to the rest of these guys. And I'm... I want to open these bags and keep them open and start adjusting them. But I want them to uh, start adjusting them to like, you know normal light, normal air, normal humidity, because it is really humid here in Houston already, or always. <laughs> um, first, let's look at these really quick. Uh, oh, cuties. Can you see? Oh, look at the details. Oh my gosh. I, uh, one of the best things about growing like cacti from seeds is at first they all just kind of look the same, little green loops, and then they start getting the little characteristics that their uh, genus and species are known for. Hi guys. And if you're curious, and I don't even know how many seeds total I started. I think it was probably, it was, well, it was definitely over 200 because I have over 200 seedlings germinating in these bags. Oh, they're all, I'm sorry, they've all germinated. Be a back out. And if I had to guess, I would say there's probably like 250, maybe 220 to 250 and over 200 germinated. They're so cute. And look at these really quick. The last one I showed you guys was Super Kabuto. And this is just a, it says Asterius, X Asterius. Not as much detail on these little guys, but still precious. Okay, and then one more. And this is gonna be the pink. Super Kabuto, oh my gosh. That means the flower's gonna be pink in three to five years. You can count those if you want to, but <laughs> I promise last time I counted it was right around, it was over 200. I could have had a few die off, but it doesn't really look like it. Mm, oh, and then I went back and I um, I added some sifted and rinsed decomposed granite. Put a little bit more. Just to kind of help give the little seedlings some support. And to, like when I watered them or if they got kind of bumped around, I didn't want them to like flop over. And it's definitely helped. I had a lot of them that were kind of leaning on the side a little bit. And... Um, now they're starting to stand up more, which they probably would on their own, just fine. So fun, so fun. 
But at this point, they don't seem to be like getting taller, of course. They're working on getting wider. And now it's just a waiting game. I, I mean, I'm going to try and look away from these for a few days because I, I look at them so much. I'm like, okay, they're not growing anymore. <laughs> but they are. They're just, it's, it's a more subtle growth. And they're working on putting out their, you know, like I said, they're filling out their bodies. Astrophytums are a you know little short wee plant they don't get very tall some of them do some astrophytums actually get very tall but over the years but the asterias tend to stay compact oh, so cool so and again i started these with a sterilized soil i'll link to the video on making that in the microwave it was a lot easier than i thought and uh, it's really worked out well because we do have fungal gnats, we have a ton of humidity, there's all kinds of stuff laying around and the soil in here is still pristine and I haven't, I, I'll, I'll see like fungal gnats, I'll see flies like in the, in the garage under the grow lights, not getting in here. Oh, and again these seeds were from Crescent City Cactus on, on Instagram and I'll link to that in the video description and if they have any available you should definitely score some uh, that that grower is out of Louisiana all right guys that's it two month follow-up Astrophyta mysterious started in February on February 8th to be exact and today is April 11th Thanks for watching. Buy my book, The Succulent Manual. We talk about all the different propagation methods, collecting seeds, starting seeds, propagating by leaves, by stems, and by division. And it's all a blast. So make sure you're doing it right. You'll get the most success by reading my book, The Succulent Manual, A Guide to Care and Repair for All Climates. And I'll link to that as well. Thanks, guys.